recording. I don't know what they're gonna show. I don't know how they're gonna spark it. How are they gonna spark it? We seen a brand new trailer. Is this campaign multiplayer? Seen Washington D.C., Pennsylvania Ave. Alert broadcast system. Oh. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. They got Killer Mike. Okay. Mm-hmm. They stand before the people as manipulators, controlling yep. power. Now I'm on the elevator. Truth lies. We holding up a dead thing. Cut yep. Feet, go dog. We the regulators. Let's go. Kill a Mike. There's a place just around the bend. A place by the name of Liberty Falls. Church. 1991's fastest growing town in America. Okay. And it's plain to see why. It's a place of simple taste. Give us a bus to ride. <laughs> they help one Ooh. Our church ain't just for Ooh. Sundays. Oh, fuck. So oh, the blinds. Yes. Nice. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, a bowling alley. That's fun. We're done to welcome you. Whoa, what the hell? What the hell? It's like a superhero power. Oh my god. Oh. Area 99. Area 99. Oh, area 99. Area 99. Welcome to the Pod Dormitory. The what? Weapons testing. Weapons testing? Mannequin assembly. The nuclear reactor. The house factory. House factory. Nuketown shipping. Nuketown. <laughs> Those are the POIs? Okay, show us, show us, show us. Safety first. When in doubt, ask what would Archie do? What would he we do? We have arrived Ooh. at the birthplace of Nuketown. Wow. The birthplace of Nuketown. Let's look at our overhead tack map of Area 99. Brittany, we're here. <laughs> we yes. made it. Yes, we made it. You said it, Stephanie. Welcome to the birthplace of Nuketown. We wow. have 10 POIs, each with their own gameplay flair and thematic connections to Nuketown. Okay. This is uniquely a Black Ops map with a ton of character. It is. We just cannot wait for players to get into this. Reactor. Yeah, and we is Test new Site Newtown? On the version of the TAC map that you're seeing here today. On the streamer's TAC map, once they're in game, it's going to look a little different. But you know what? This is where we're headed for launch. We're obviously okay. going to see alpha gameplay of Area 99. We got live gameplay coming up on Area 99 in just a few minutes. But first, let's take a closer look at our points of interest. Brittany, take us away. Yeah, Nuketown. So Area 99, you're parachuting in. What's the first thing you see? Our Nuketown house suspended midair. It is what? so awesome. Up here, you have a view of other Nuketown houses that have been swallowed up by the sands of time. Then we have our test site. Okay. This is where experimental weapons are tested. The okay. observant player may recognize that we have a prototype guardian in the space, which is a fun nod. Lots of uh, little oh. treats. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's cool. That's, that's pretty cool. 
that POI connects to our underground bunker space. So down here, the players are more self-contained, separated from the chaos on the surface. That's but cool. I recommend grabbing a gas mask before going down there. Okay. Mm -hmm. Then we have our it's bunker space. Zone. This is our bullseye in the center of the map. It's also our tallest POI with multiple levels. But what's most important about this POI is actually that it is connected to every single other POI in the map through okay. a network of trenches. And it's got radioactive oh, goo. Okay. There's we'll, also radioactive goo. You will take damage from. <laughs> yeah, trust me. Yeah. We have our manufacturing POI. Oh, this is so where okay. the town houses are made. This space is fun. We have oh, doors, windows okay. being carried throughout the space. There may or may not be a sneaky zip line in here somewhere. I'm not going to tell you where it is. <laughs> okay. You have to go and find you out. Gotta go find it. Oh, I love everything about this. <laughs> yes. Then we have our mannequin assembly space. This place is really fun. So, okay, the backstory of this is it has been overproducing mannequins throughout the years, not, and now- Not scary at all. It's yeah. a little bit creepy. <laughs> yeah. Players get to run through massive piles of mannequins. Mannequin limbs are just tossed throughout. It's As one does. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Don't get squashed by our mannequin smasher. And then we have our pods. This is where the people who were screaming in the 1990s used to live. This is a fun stacked smaller engagements. And players here really need to listen for those footsteps of other players in order to hone in on their targets. I mean, this just looks <laughs> okay. so cool. Pod's Everything about final this. circle, absolutely wild. Oh, yeah. I, really, oh, yeah. I really hope absolutely. we see one today in play testing. Final circle on pods, you're going to have one of the wildest fights I've seen in Resurgence oh, yeah. in a long time. And something that stands out to me just looking at that overhead map real fast is uh, a lot of a lot of color. You yeah. know, a lot of visual yeah. color that, that's yeah. really going to stand yes. out when you're, like, moving through the map. You really yeah, get you the like green that, pod, like, yellow well, pod, yeah. I'm going into yeah, new I'm going into Yeah, this looks fire. Absolutely. This looks fire. critical for us. What's coming in? What's coming in? What's coming in? I'll put it up. I'll put it up. I'll put it up. I'll put it up. We're taking selfies, you know. They're just walking around with a, with a, was it a disposable camera? You got to do it for the gram, right? You got to do it for the gram. That's how you know we're in the 90s. All right. Well, gentlemen, we have had a chance to cover a lot of the global systems that we're going to be seeing in Black Ops 6 today. Of course, that includes Omni Movement. Yeah. So like 1,500 That's times cool. now. That's yeah. cool. And for good reason, because it really is a big deal. And it is coming to Warzone. We've seen some incredible moments there, Pete. I mean, really, this is it looks just good. the way that we play the game. Absolutely. It looks so really good. This year, our core design pillars really revolve around fluidity, simplification of systems, and player agency. So when we heard about Treyarch's uh, global systems coming this year to Black Ops 6, we were really excited about the play potential that this could bring to Warzone, yeah. specifically with Omni movement, right? So if you think about nice. it, just the, having the ability to dive, slide, and sprint mm -hmm. in any direction, it's a real game changer. It's going to add a new dynamic element to yeah. what, the way players will engage in the combat. We've already seen a ton of clips in multiplayer. We've seen it in the first yep. match already. Like yeah. it's just gonna go bananas. It's basically just the way I'm gonna lose all my ones just because of on me on me move. Yep. I'm telling you, it's like I'm gonna get absolutely cooked. I can't wait to I can't wait to get cooked though. Yeah. <laughs> the Omni movement is just one of the many systems coming from Black Ops Six. It, you talked about the global system. One of many. What one other? Of the most exciting new features that we'll be doing across the titles are global weapon builds. Lawrence, you mentioned global this earlier weapon in the builds. Section. This is a huge quality of life change. What does it mean for players? What is it? Yeah, so global weapon builds make it easier than ever to create and maintain and access your weapons wherever you play, whether it's multiplayer, zombies, or Warzone. Every gun you create in Black Ops 6 or Warzone mm -hmm. is a global weapon build by default. Okay. And connected everywhere you can use you it. Use it everywhere. So you can yes. slot it into a loadout. If you make an edit to that global weapon build, it applies everywhere it's equipped. Amazing. Massive. No longer going <laughs> Holy in crap. one by one, loadout by loadout, and keeping your guns up to date. That's dope. Uh, That's dope. Global weapon builds also exist outside of loadouts. So if mm. you swap, a, let's say, your short range XM4 build out of a loadout in exchange for maybe Latanto SMG, but you can go back to that XM4 at any time. It's a permanent creation and uh, oh, okay. makes it easier than ever That's for players dope. to maintain their guns. That's dope. And That's dope. If you're that player who jumps into Black Ops 6 at launch, has your favorite guns, has your favorite weapon yeah. builds, when Season 1 drops and, and the Warzone integration happens, you can easily bring over all of those guns. Uh, That's huge. Super easily. I, I think uh, Absolutely huge. Yeah. I mean, you mentioned Tanto XM. I feel like that's 
might be the meta in the room at the moment, <laughs> yeah. ironically. But. I know, it's great. You're hearing everyone talk about it. It's wild. But now, uh, and there are going to be a, a few specific things as well that we're going to be seeing, like perks and loadouts. So they're going to be yeah. working a little bit differently. Uh, you know, in Warzone. What's well, going to work differently? Can you just take us through that, how that's going to play out, how that's going to look for the players? Yeah, there's quite a few changes happening this year with, in terms of loadouts. Okay. First and foremost, wild cards are coming to Warzone. Ooh. Really what does that mean? Because we really feel that this is going to be disruptive in a good way to yes. players kind of strategize and think about which loadouts to take and how they build them. So the two that we're showing off today are Overkill and Gunfighter. So Overkill is back. Used to be a perk, no, but now it is a classic, and this yep. time it's, it lives on as a wild card. So for those that don't know, uh, Overkill allows you to take two primary weapons with five <laughs> attachments on it. You might want to do that. Like there might be an engagement that you might want to get into, and you yeah. have an AR, SMG, sniper, shotgun, whatever suits your fancy. You can make that choice right there and then. But mm -hmm. if you don't want to do that, we're also showing off another wild card today, and that's Gunfighter. Gunfighter allows Gun you to fire. have one primary weapon yep. and one pistol and the primary weapon Dang. can have up to eight attachments. So if you really think about it, if you take the right kind of weapon and put yeah. on the right type of attachments on it, that might be the thing that, that turns the tide of fire. fight. I have, a lot, I have a feeling a lot of people are gonna use yeah. gunfighter. Absolutely. <laughs> we also that have more that's coming and we'll talk about fire. those like, as we get closer to launch. For sure. Those yeah. wild cards are gonna be built specifically for Warzone in mind. Oh, that's cool. Yes. Yeah, that's cool. So Very more cool. coming as we look to the live seasons post launch, but Ted, one of the things you've done is actually revisit some of the underutilized perks and, you know, kind of look at how we might use them for this chapter. Yeah, so our design team looked at the equip rates of all of the perks over the last year and just how players have used them. And we've taken, like, what would previously have been, like, bottom tier perks, clearly not much value, yeah. combine some of them together. Some examples being uh, we took Combat Scout and Tracker. Uh, so for anyone who's familiar with Combat, the combat Scout, scouts, you, you Tracker, yep. ping them, uh, and we've combined yes. them together just to be Tracker because it felt like it's really the same play style, same player motivation. Right, that's lit. That everyone in here is going to love. It's got a new name, Sprinter. Sprinter, and, uh, what is that? Combined, um, what would be uh, double time perks from from the, the, the previous game yeah uh, and uh, so things like uh, double time uh, there's a perk that we have in the mm -hmm. game at the moment where when you're down you move quicker and then on top of that we've added infinite tax sprint oh, okay. oh, so oh like shit the, in the pre reef until some of the creators the the eruption uh, for that piece was, was just phenomenal. So. Uh, with Omni movement in, uh, on top of all of yeah, that, we're going to yeah. see some pretty exciting movement in the game. But Infinite Tax um, Break is a perk. One quick thing I want to touch on. W, bro. Prestige coming to Warzone. This is new oh, for man. us. Yeah, so classic Prestige in Black Ops 6 is truly a global system. Whether you're playing multiplayer, zombies, or Warzone, you're earning XP towards your next Prestige. And we've That's had dope. classic prestige in Warzone. It's a first for the franchise. Uh, really excited to see how Warzone players engage with the system. Wow, I, I'm, I'm the fact that we're gonna just rank is, uh, rank up. That's general. what we're gonna do. That's going. what it's not gonna be uh, like uh, about going to one area. I, I'm I'm stoked. I'm in. This is great. This is great. And it's not the only thing that we have in Warzone because for the very first I'm gonna be time, prestige Warzone match before Warzone one dedicated camera. Are you serious? <laughs> it Look, is? We're pumped about this. We're seeing these mastery oh, camos. Oh, right that's here. dope. That's, that's what yeah, they were showing. So as you guys have been seeing through the broadcast, we've been going big with mastery camos this year. Uh, we have an updated camo yeah. system, and for the first time ever in Warzone, you will have dedicated I mean, the red and black one look fire. Warzone camo challenges geared towards things you can do in Warzone. This is your oh, first look at Abyss. Sick. It's dynamic. It changes Abyss. when you shoot it. Uh, I gotta see it in game. Mastery camos. That we've oh, that looked fire when, when you, you, when you yeah, keep shooting, I, I it looks fire. The <laughs> eight attachments. We're gonna see some absolute okay. stack builds. Let's check this out. These weapons are just gonna do damage from range. Put some through on the left. Oh, oh, that sounds ridiculous. Yeah. <laughs> Be a super soldier. Hey, this is a crazy drop an ammo box. The swag, he's gonna make his way. He and his team across the wall oh. here. Right there, right there, right there, right there. 
UAV in the back pocket still wants this one in. So these guys, they're on the Nice, nice. Find the car. Yep. There we go. W. There they are. W. <laughs> that was a big one. It might not be 51, Chris. That's the record we've seen so far in the day. Chica is a monster across multiple BRs. Would not be surprised to see her in the double digits right there with the fellas. Yep. And 14 yep. for Jay's 45. move. 21 for Swag and 10, 10 for yep. Chica. 45. Damn it. Bad ass. With it. Just an evolution. Breadman, Lula, Kane, Brown. Sniping, going for the snipe. And towards the end of this one, nine players remaining, four squads. Sure, he's in the he truck, the shot. and he's got the he's got the combo, the LR and the Ames. Yep, and yep. Ames is stacked for range, man. Look at that bad boy. As you mentioned, right now it, the wild cards are you can run primary gunfire. Ooh, and nice! Oh, and he got him out. Nailed it. I mean, that's a big one. This is a, a huge moment here. It's a resurgence. Is he another squad win. Watch out for the players. Oh, 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 oh. Man. Brad, no, 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 don't peek it. Don't peek it, don't peek it, don't peek it. No, no, no. Where's his teammates at? Teammates to the right. Yeah, to the right, to the right, to the right. He's just trying to play cut off. He's a one-man army right now. Ooh. He's doing a perfect. Oh! No, no, go for it. Don't go for it. Don't go for it. Don't go for it, bro. I like the medals, though. We've got to get out of this. Got to get out of the gas. Look at the situation moving. they're in. There's three buys behind them. They do have money. So That's if anybody dies, the buyback is coming in right away. And they have zones. So, Breadman... And his squad, dope, 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 looking like they're going to secure this dub. Armor box, always nice to have late game here. Keep yeah, the squad yeah, yeah, yeah. feeling mm -hmm. fresh. Oh, another big rotation. Nearly the same one we saw Swag's team have. So they've got to vacate this low ground, get up over that large bit of wall, oh. and get into the next circle. Yeah, that's going to be the hard nice. part. Nice! Right nice! Are, both Redman hitting shots like that, I don't think they really oh. need to worry about Oh, it. my God. Oh, go, go, go back, go back, go back, go back. Heal, 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 heal. shots himself, and his teammates got to give him some help the in this situation. The rotation is going to pull them back up top so they have to fight the zone and their opponent does he have a gas mask it no. doesn't look like it so he's in a very tough spot how do you fix your war zone i don't know what you mean brother i don't know what you mean you on a youtube so so yeah you on youtube precision a dangerous place to be in right now the circle though give me a second give me a second after the after this uh dub after this stuff how did they let them get in this position the enemy team had them in a box that in the lower ground oh, and oh, oh, somehow oh. snuck their way through the gas they're gonna be on the roofs and this is i think gonna be a 2v2 right now a couple of gunfights nice going out, nice that circle is still closing in slowly but surely on the enemy what team. was that what kind of bomb is that it was like a c4 but he didn't have to detonate it oh oh Okay, okay. Last, circle, last circle, last circle, last circle. Enemy down. That was a squad wipe. We got one more to beat. Got one more. Yep. Let's get no, 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 no. Don't. No. Chill. Chill. Oh, chill. Why did you go? Nice, 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 nice. Nice, 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 nice. Go get in the circle. Get in the circle. Get in the circle. Play, play, play. Good shit. Good shit. Good shit. Daddy. Gamer, Fred the Trash. You trash, Freddy? Your mama!